Hi Aries, how are you? Welcome to your reading. My name is Tavis. Welcome to Tavis Tarot. This is going to be your reading for mid-July all the way to the end of the month. Personal readings are being offered. Aries, if interested, to send me an email, it's in the description box below. And also check your flower reading, which has been done. Now let's see for our dear Aries spirit, what is the energy? What does Aries need to know? What is the energy for our dear Aries spirit? What is happening right now in regards to Aries? Okay, interesting. A lot of watching. <laughs> okay, so let me just see what's going on. The hawk almost came through in reverse. I feel like there's a um, person here who wants to reach to you, Aries. I feel like there could be a person who is either out of your reach this could be somebody that you're not available to, okay? Whether there's no access from this person to you. I definitely feel like this could be somebody that you either, like, cut off or... Yeah, I keep getting, like, they can't reach you. Maybe they could reach you at a certain point, but they can't reach you anymore. But we're going to tap on to see what this is speaking of. Hmm. Interesting. So the bond to take care for you, we have the fish energy, mouse, and the unicorn and the phoenix yeah i feel like there's definitely this focus on self-growth for the time being when it comes to your energy aries let me just ship shape this okay there we go you could be very focused on self-growth um, some of you could be very busy with your work situation as well, trying to get things done. I see you earning a lot of money. Okay, there's definitely a lot of abundance. And this is because of the hard work that you've been putting in that's going to pay off for you here. Now, I think I might have mentioned before, some of you definitely around full moon, something could be happening, which is about a week from now, a week and some days from now. Okay, so there could be messages perhaps around that time for you. Or there's something here coming onto the surface. There's something becoming known to you. Something becoming exposed. All right. Now, you could be connecting with a water sign. Okay. We have earth energy and air coming through. Or this person could have these placements within their chart. What I am seeing here is something is being manifested. Aries. And for a lot of you, this is in regards to the way you want to be treated okay let's say by other people some of you you could be manifesting a lot of respect you could be manifesting uh, good boundaries healthy boundaries in regards to your connections as well um some of you this is interesting because i feel like you could be also um having a healthier connection with your parents you know or you could be healing your connections with your parents specifically with a mother figure i'm tapping onto here for you okay so you could be healing your um connection with your mother okay or forgiveness energy is here for sure now why do i feel like there's a person here that definitely misses or craves for your availability <laughs> Aries. so again i don't know if you know you're no longer available to this person some of you this person could speak different languages or they could come from a different background but i'm getting something with communication maybe communication hasn't been good you know, maybe this person has just been able to watch you or keep tabs on you, but they haven't been able to see you in person or come to you, right? But definitely we will tap onto this to see what is happening for you, all right? But I'm seeing you being very focused on your dreams for the time being here. Almost a Virgo. Some of you could be connecting with a Virgo as well. But let's see. Let's see what's happening for our dear Aries spirit. I just heard milestones. Some of you could be reaching milestones in regards to your career and finances. Look at that. Can you see that? The same <laughs> situation with shuffling came through Cancer's reading. So I'm wondering if something's... Oh my goodness, now cards are flying. Give me a minute. I'm wondering if something is uh, taking its time to come to fruition in your life, okay? Some of you, this could be an aggressive connection that's taking its time, taking its course, I just heard. Um, this also could be speaking of you needing to be, be patient in regards to your plans and projects. I have no idea what is going on. So let's see here for our dear Aries Spirit. What is the energy 
And what is happening again? Look at that, you guys. This has never happened. Like, Whew. all right, let's see. Maybe there's some blockages right now in regards to communication or something is not coming through. Maybe a person is not coming through. We're going to see. We're going to see what's happening for our dear Aries spirit. What is the energy? Oh, okay. That was very, un <laughs> that was very unexpected. Anything that you're working on right now, this will pay off, okay? It's something I keep wanting to say. So definitely keep focusing on it. Now, okay, at the bottom of the deck for you here, we have the Ace of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles in reverse. Okay. I feel, Aries, that there's going to be a beautiful opportunity in regards to you and a person, okay? It's like there's going to be an opportunity between you and somebody, and this is also in regards to something that is rather unfinished, okay? Some of you, I feel like this is definitely in regards to a connection that um, you feel like you've invested a lot in, okay? You feel like you and this person already have gone a long way together, okay? You have been putting a lot of effort, you've been investing a lot. And I also feel like for a lot of you, there is a person who will be coming towards you to put in more effort, to show up, okay, more than before. Very similar to Cancer's reading, if you want to check that out, if you have Cancer within your chart. Now, some of you, I do also feel like, do not let a situation rather block your blessings, okay? Because there's an energy of, if one door closes, and the next door will open up for you. If one person does not give you what you want, another person will and can give you what you want, okay? So be really certain in regards to not closing yourself off towards options towards people especially if you're single if you're not committed to a person okay that message is coming through so me i'm also hearing you might have been in a situation ship as well maybe you just do not necessarily know where you stand with the person but i keep feeling like um really protect yourself protect yourself meaning really take the time to rest take the time to be gentle with yourself because for a lot of you Air Aries I feel like either you've been putting somebody else on a pedestal here or this also speaking of focusing on a situation too much to the point where you forget about yourself and you cross your own boundaries to reach to someone okay so I definitely feel like you really deserve to rest and you deserve to take a break now for some of you if you're on a break right now from a person I also feel like you're going to be using this time to care for yourself more and focus on self-love and that that could be also your advice here okay now let me just see more definitely i'm seeing forgiveness with family members this message came through for you in your last reading as well very boldly we're going to tap on to see who's coming towards you right now i'm also seeing reconciliation energy so for some of you if you haven't been seeing a person you haven't been seeing let's say a friend a family member um significant other definitely i see the energy of making peace coming together seeing each other meeting up and this could be happening within three weeks okay to 10 days now we're gonna see who's coming towards aries spirit for the time being and what is their intention who's coming towards aries what is their intention and how do they feel towards Aries? Who is this person coming towards Aries? This is a person who has a lot of emotions. Wow, strong water energy. Some of you could be connected with the water sign. Taurus is here, Earth as well. This is a person who's not... <laughs> this is a person who would not necessarily wear their heart on their sleeve. Some of you, I keep stuttering. So either a person really has a hard time communicating with you, or this could be your energy too. But... If a person's kind of like showing you like they're fine, that everything's okay, that everything's normal, I don't feel like that's the case. There is a person who really deeply cares for you. And this could be somebody who either at a certain point, they felt like a friend, like you either friends on this person, you either kind of cut them off. Some of you, I feel like, I just heard you humbled them. I don't, I don't know why I'm hearing you like that. You humbled this person. Hmm. There's just an energy of this person has feelings for you, but at a certain point, they didn't feel comfortable enough to show you their feelings. So I don't know whether there, there's been barriers between you two, or this is also speaking of a person who's acting like your friend, but has more feelings for you than just a friend. 
I, I wonder whether you kind of put up a boundary with this person or you kind of like put them in friend zone. Okay, that could be a possibility. But for a lot of you, this person could be hiding the fact that they want something long term with you. Okay, if some of you, you two have been apart, this person really misses connecting with you. They really miss giving to you. They really miss the times that you two have been having together as well. Somebody could also work into healthcare or charity. Um, somebody could be into teaching. Okay, they could be a teacher or work in a particular community. Somebody could also be into spirituality or use spiritual gifts as their work as well. Okay, some, some of you, you could also work with kids or it could be this person, but we're going to see definitely. church somebody could go to church or somebody could work in a church we're gonna see so spirit what is this connection about could we know more in regards to this before we do the outcome could you tell us more in regards to this person coming through towards this person has feelings oh my god you got i don't know if you made this person feel like you didn't choose them at a certain point aries but you can, again, switch it up. I, I just feel like there's an energy of we don't... I have feelings for you, but we don't want the same things. You know what I mean? It's like, maybe we don't have the same values. We don't have the same goals. This is somebody who's really holding back from you right now, you guys. Very much. I keep getting water energy, earth energy, some of you as well. Libra is here too. But this is somebody who's been really withholding from you. And I also feel like this is a big denier. You know, like somebody who would deny their feelings just so they don't get hurt or they could be also very traditional for some of you. OK, or they could want to have a family or be committed or it could be you. But I keep getting this energy of like somebody who keeps their feelings to themselves. And it is because either they feel like you don't want the same things, you don't have the same values, or this is also speaking of a person who feels like. You're not choosing them, but they're choosing you. You know what I mean? I just feel like something here was not reciprocal at a certain point. Um, like you went to the cancer, so I'm going to be connected with the cancer as well, or air energy. So what's going to be the outcome, spirit? What is the outcome? What is going to be the outcome here? Some of you might have had a false start with this person, or you might have felt like, I am, I don't know why this keeps happening, you guys. This has never happened in a reading, like, ever in my life. Just look at it. Uh, either you had a false start with this person, or things might have been really lusty between you two. Like, I don't know if you have been very intimate, like, right from the get-go. Some of you might have felt like things were really hot and heavy in the beginning of this connection as well. But yeah, it's almost like I need to push the cards. You know what I mean when I'm shuffling. So I wonder whether, whether things might have been really slow or not moving forward at all. What is the outcome? Yeah, the outcome is communication. The outcome is movement. What is the outcome spirit and what will happen for Aries? What will happen for Aries? What will happen for Aries? <laughs> mm -hmm. This is a person who's not being honest with you in regards to their feelings. What's the outcome and what will happen, spirit? I feel like there's going to be a turnaround here. I feel like for most of you, there's going to be a turnaround. This is definitely somebody that either at a certain point things came to a halt or things just abruptly ended is something I'm hearing for some of you, okay? But you're connecting with a person who's been holding back, Aries. Holding back. All right, Scorpio energy, some of you could be as well. But what I'm seeing is the outcome is there's going to be communication for a lot of you. August is very significant as well. But I'm feeling like there's going to be a change in regards to this connection. All right. And again, it's very important whether you want the same things. So I don't know if for some of you, let's say during the break, somebody was playing the field, somebody was kind of keeping their options open, but there's an energy of somebody still hung upon you, or there's an energy of things are still not done with you. So they, they can just move on like that. Get what I mean? It's like, I've already invested so much time in this. Why would I want to move on? I want to see where this goes type of energy. Okay. Is there any other messages in regards to this before I do prediction spirit for Aries? Any prediction um any other messages yeah 
any advice for our dear Aries spirit? I wonder, like some of you, I don't know if this person made you feel like there's another person in the mix or you did, but there's an energy of at a certain point, somebody was given the impression that the other person has options or they're not solely focused on the other person. All right. Yes. Like at a certain point, somebody felt like they loved the other person more you know like it, things were not reciprocal like the feelings were not mutual i keep getting this energy and that's why they kind of like withdrew pisces energy some of you leo but i'm seeing forward movement with this for sure i'm seeing emotions coming through it's just very slow and i think part of the reason why it's slow is because somebody's afraid to know whether the other person feels mutually in love or not does this make sense some of you could also be physically apart from this person or it could be that you haven't seen them for a while okay you could be also planning to travel as well within the next two months i would say two to four months yeah all right somebody could also play sports or do coaching maybe as well or maybe some of you met at the gym or you meet at the gym a small portion of you all right Let's see if there's any predictions for Aries Spirit. Any predictions? You could be receiving a call or a text from this person, okay? Can we know anything more about this spirit before I do predictions? I don't know why I keep wanting to clarify. Some of you, I feel like you might need more information on this. Can you tell us more in regards to what will happen, Spirit? Yeah, again, there's going to be a person who's going to be um, opening up to you. See the two cups. And I feel like this is somebody who's been waiting on you to connect with them and communicate with them. All right. They've been waiting on you. They've been waiting on you to go to them for some of you. But this is somebody who's been waiting and waiting for you, Aries. Okay. So if you've been wondering... I feel like for a lot of you, this person has been holding back and they've been waiting on you to come and talk to them. This person could kind of like at a certain point, either you rejected them or they felt like neglected is something I just heard. Like they felt like you don't want them. Okay. Or they, f I'm even getting like insecurity energy. Like, am I your type type of energy? You know what I mean? I don't know why I just got that in my head. That's very specific. Some of you Leo, this person could also have within their chart or fire. Any predictions do we have for our dear Aries spirit? Oh, Cancer got this. Stars, beautiful. So yeah, something's transpiring. Something is definitely transpiring. And for a lot of you, this also is speaking of uh, milestones, having big accomplishments in your future. Um, you definitely, it's very important for you, Aries, to hold on to your vision right now, honey, okay? To be really focused because I feel like you have big dreams and it's important to you, for you to keep your feet on the ground and be grounded in regards to your dreams and keep being consistent. Put in the effort every day. Wake up every day, put in the effort, you know, work and be disciplined basically in regards to your dreams is what the spirit wants for you to know. Tell me about the cloud spirit. Yeah. Let me just have all the cards. Tell me about the cloud spirit. Yeah, you've been connecting with an energy that might have been really confusing, Aries. You might have been connected with a person who's been confusing you. Like, either they're in and out of your life, or this is also speaking of a person who's very, like, fickle. All right. I also feel like part of the reason why this is very confusing is because this probably... This person probably didn't know what they wanted when they met you. I'm just going to be honest. I don't know. I just got that. Like, this person probably was not even... They didn't know, They didn't even know what they were looking for when they met you. Like, maybe they even told you they don't know what they want. But it's like... I don't know why I would get something so random. I feel like for a lot of you within the summer, things are going to definitely get clear between you and this person. And I feel like it's been especially taking a while, especially if you two have been kind of like taking a break or somebody might have been moving slow towards you i feel like this definitely will come to light all right but i keep wanting to say aries like i'm not quite sure again who you're dealing with because i'm reading for thousands of people out there right 
it's going to differ for all of you but there's an energy of just because one situation is not working out it doesn't mean that you need to wait and sigh and sigh and sigh and wait on that person to do something right when you can also be open to other options especially again if you're single or if there's no attachments is something I keep noticing in your reading okay so some of you I would really suggest you go out I would suggest you go and meet people um, and this again doesn't have to be something romantic it just be platonic but just to keep your mind off things you know especially if things have not been really going well Gemini energy some you can could be connecting with or Leo this person could also be a little bit moody okay earth energy as well is coming through I don't know why I just got that in my head, moody. Like, you could feel like they want you one minute and then they don't want you. Or it's like, you, know, you can never tell. I just feel like you've been wanting, like, a sense of determination from them. And you just have not been seeing it. So that's why you're kind of like, it's been confusing. Any angel messages do we have for our dear um, Aries? Any angel messages? So we could be connecting with the Virgo. Any angel messages do we have for our dear Aries? Letters S T D R G N C Z as well as uh, B and V and W and H could be significant. Okay, somebody could have two Z's, A's, H. We have S D and ends within their name. Okay, whether it's you or them. F as well as here. Okay. Any angel messages do we have for our dear Aries spirit? Any angel messages? We have two. Okay. Positive recognition. Congratulations. Your plans have worked out perfectly and now it's your time to shine. Brilliant new ideas will present themselves to you and success is all but assured. Express yourself openly and honestly knowing that those surrounding you are trustworthy. Be open to unexpected opportunities. So yeah, the spirit is really telling you that there's going to be a, a, some form of an achievement, accomplishment. Some of you I just heard lesson as well. Um, but this is definitely something related to your work and finances, I feel. There's definitely this energy of prosperity, making money, um, you know, goals coming true. This is speaking of victory. All right, so it's a beautiful energy. I feel like you're going to be starting to really be recognized for what you do or what you bring. Um, some of you, there could be a promotion or a raise as well, for sure. Messenger of action. Something new and exciting related to your creativity or your career comes to your attention. You feel an eagerness to learn and you're ready to get going. Although you may feel insecure, do it anyway. This card represents someone in your life or maybe you who is creative, enthusiastic, and fascinated by life and who wants to try everything. So yeah, it could be time for you to kind of get going. You know, I kind of felt the energy when I was shuffling your cards as well. Um, so for a lot of you, I feel like this is about getting going. This is about starting to take action, okay? No longer waiting on something, but just getting going. Going on about your business, you know, and this is also speaking of there could be a lot of messages coming in soon. And for a lot of you, it could be that you're going to be invited to somewhere. Some of you could be traveling. There could be a lot of new messages. I just see you being really busy, you know, to the point where things that might have confu confused you a lot once are not going to be confusing you anymore because you're just like busy with other things okay but for a lot of you i do see also movement with this particular connection that i just tapped onto as well coming through okay so this is all i have for you i hope that this helps you um aries personal readings are being offered definitely you can go ahead and write to me to my email to book a reading with me it's in the description box hit that like button for me do like share and subscribe to my channel for more content i'm sending my kiss mm -hmm. my warm base and my little light take care and i'll see you next time bye bye honey